What's up guys, it's Frank here from AFTV Young Guns. As you know, the fixture list for the Premier League came out on the 14th of June 2017. And I was a bit worried because in the past few years we've not had the greatest of fixture lists. We've always had like a really hard month and then a really easy month and then a really hard month for example. Like it's been on and off, on and off. But with this one it's a little bit more balanced out. I want to start off with the first month of the season which is in August. We do kick off on the 12th of August against Leicester City and it is a home game so hopefully I should be going to that one actually but it should be a fairly easy start for us in the Premier League obviously we've lost two years in a row opening games of the season the last time we lost at home on the first game of the season was against Liverpool Liverpool at Anfield now this is the one I'm actually worried about because we always struggle at Anfield it's a hard hard place to go to Anfield and that's really the only challenge that we have in that first month. September doesn't look that bad except from Chelsea away on the 16th and also in that month we've got Brighton and Hove Albion on the 30th and again that's a home game. That's nice to see that we're playing against a promoted team very early on. I think that should be an easy three points for us. October looks fine and then November is a little bit harder. We've got Manchester City and the first North London derby of the year and it's at home so we've got home advantage there that should be a really good game i'm really looking forward to that if i do end up going to that game and then we move on to december now there's a massive cluster of games starting off with manchester united at home last time we played manchester united at home that was the first match i did for aftv young guns the confidence levels when i get to that point depend on how good we are doing leading up to that game. Uh, another, we've got another promoted team and that is Newcastle. We always have a good game against Newcastle guys. I remember that absolutely brilliant game against Newcastle. It was 4-4. To be honest we should have won it but Newcastle showed a lot of heart to get back into that. Rest in peace. Check Teote. Now February. Do you know what? January looks fine. It's only Chelsea that we've really got to worry about on the 1st. February is probably our hardest month. It starts off with Everton at home, fair enough, that's very that, that, that's it, we always play. Again, we play a good game against Everton all the time, but then it starts to look bad for us from there. Tottenham away, that's going to be at Wembley Stadium. Uh, obviously, Tottenham playing their home games at Wembley this season. And then on the 24th of February, we have Manchester City at home. Now again, another team that we play really good matches against, City... March looks very easy, only real challenge we could have, no there's no challenges at all there I don't think, uh, Brighton, Watford, Leicester, Stoke, and that's a Stoke home game. April, um, the only real challenge we have there is Manchester United away, it's at Old, that's at Old Trafford, a very intimidating stadium to go to, as I've heard because I've never been to Old Trafford, that's one that I really do want to go to actually. And then in May... The season does finish early due to the World Cup. We've only got two games in May and that's against Burnley at home on the 5th. And then we do finish the season away to Huddersfield. Yeah. So guys, if you do want to see the full fixture list, there will be one coming up on the screen about now. But I'm really looking forward to this season. I think if we make the right signings and the, club, the club's problems get sorted out basically, we could have a very strong season, especially with this fixture list. It's not a very... It's not a, it's not a very up and down season for us. It doesn't look like because it looks like there's a very it looks it looks very balanced in all the months apart from maybe February we could struggle. But in my opinion, this is probably the best draw that we've had in a few years, and I'm really looking forward to this season. But let me know what you guys thought of the draw. Thank you for watching this video. Frank from FTV Young Guns. See you next time.